Ms. Vasquez, can I ask you about your uh, key tam lawsuit? Actually, I would love to know. Yeah, that's the office. Okay. Why did you deny saying that you didn't file the lawsuit and then you actually did? Why did you mislead us for so long? Uh, I actually never denied uh, filing the lawsuit. What I denied was filing uh, a lawsuit against the Central Basin. And let's talk about it. Uh, the Ketam lawsuit is about, uh, it's a lawsuit that was filed against two of the former law firms that were doing work here for the Central Basin. And they secretly moved out $2.7 million. But why did you deny and being involved lawsuit, in it for so many months? And I'll answer that question. This lawsuit is about getting back $2.7 million that was secretly and improperly moved out of the town. How much are you entitled to get out of the lawsuit if you were to win? And let me, uh, let me answer. That's a direct question. question. Yeah. Let me ask her. What was the other question that you asked me? Direct question. How much money are you, are you plan, are, How much money will you make if you end up winning your lawsuit against well, the district? You know what, uh, Mr. Economy, this is not about me, me making money. This is about, and let me explain. Any chance here? This is about the Central Basin getting back its money uh, that was improperly taken out of the district. Hold on. When when we're successful, the Central Basin will get back all of its money, all of its money that was improperly taken out. And if the judge decides that any additional money uh, is, uh, is going to be distributed, that money will be used to actually finance the ethics committee that I have uh, so I've been so aggressive about uh, getting back uh, here. So, um, but but again, why did you why did you never come forward to tell anybody that you were actually involved in a lawsuit like this? Why did you? I mean, you denied it, denied it, denied it, and then we we asked you, and you 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 made public comments saying that you know. Uh, well, Mr. Hughes and Mr. Economy, one of the accusations that you made was that. Um, or the reports, according to the newspaper, was that I was suing the Central Basin. I have no intention uh, of suing the Central Basin. I never followed. But you're the principal. Central you're the principal plaintiff in the lawsuit. I'm suing on behalf of Central Basin. On behalf of Central Basin or the taxpayers or yourself? On behalf of the Central Basin and all of the constituents. How much assistance did you get from Ron Wilson in regards to the filing of this lawsuit? Absolutely none. Uh, in fact, this lawsuit. An attorney that is already on file. And you know, uh, Mr. Connery, let's focus on the facts. The facts are that $2.7 million were improperly moved out of this district, secretly moved out of this district, by our attorneys and our general manager. It's never been accounted for. And the members of our district deserve uh, to get their money back. And that's what this lawsuit is about. It's about getting money back uh, for our constituents. How successful are you to think that you're going to win the lawsuit? Uh, we're quite sure that uh, we are going to be successful. Okay. Thank you very much. And You're welcome. Again, let's go and have a, 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 if you have more questions, I'm always open, you know, to having a conversation with you. As long as you're open to uh, to having a very truthful and open dialogue about what's happening here at Central Basin. Thank you for your comments.